welcome to our art b and And here, it does not look much like art, but I promise you, you know, before you stop watching, you are gonna see some incredible art, both by artists that on you know canvas and a musician. But what I really wanna tell you right now is all about this amazing 100-year-old building that my husband, Dwayne, and I lovingly restored. Now, um, I'm Tiffany Youngren from 41 Realty Group. So we had a co with Tyler Sampson, and my husband, Dwayne, did most of the work here along with the help of a lot of his friends. This space right here, Miranda is behind the camera. She's amazing. She is going to show you around this room a little bit. But this is the living room space. And from here, you can go into the kitchen. If you needed to use more of the space for commercial, you can see that there's just a ton of room there. Several exterior doors, the apartment, there's a one bedroom apartment that also has its own address separate from the retail. If you want me to use it as two different spaces. We stuck with, uh, you know, obviously it's, it's an old building. We refinished a lot of the floors, the floors that we couldn't refinish. We installed new floors. Really cute now is exactly what you need. It's super close to some of the best food, some of the best restaurants, live entertainment, all within very short walking distance. Today it's what, negative eight? It's super cold and it's like blizzard, snowing, windy, but in here it's just really nice and cozy. We can see the doors and things just really reflect back to the time but have just enough of the new urban uh, look that we want to keep because we're downtown. We're so close to everything. Just outside of the apartment or part of the apartment is what I call the flex space. You can see there's an exterior door. It can either be used as part of the living space or part of the commercial state spaces, which is why we call it the flex space. As you leave the flex space, you get high ceilings, you get clearly commercial. And that door leads to the outside, which is a completely fenced backyard with a shed. This used to be a ceramics store and studio, and right over there was where they had the kiln, which was pretty amazing. When we bought it, it was full of ceramics, so um, it was really cool to know some of the history behind it as well. We're going to enter the retail space where you're going to find a musician, amazing artwork, and a great space, so be imagining what you can use that space for and either comment or message or text us and ask us if you have any questions about the art artist, you wanna be connected with them, about the musician, especially if you can imagine what you wanna do in this space you're about to see. Again, I'm not gonna say much, it's a little bit loud, but you're gonna see the amazing possibilities that, are, that lie within. <laughs> Thank you.